Hello everybody, we're playing a dangerous game with lava and waters. Thought you were gonna say lava and vodka. Wow. Well, that's the that's the kind of the real kicker, isn't it? <laughs> lava vodka. There, yes. Hence why I'm stood on the table and you're down on the ground. I have to do. Well, you did utter the words. Sorry. I can't. I have to walk for my water. Okay. Uh huh. How are we doing? Well, you did utter the words before we got started that um, if it, if we died, it was my fault. Yeah, I mean, most of because I'm doing the lava. Mm -hmm. How much do we actually need for this thing? Well, we want ten for the um, Nether portal, mm -hmm. and I want fifteen. I want an extra five for um, other stuff. Okay. There we go. Fifteen. Cool. So we switch it back to cobblestone? Mm-hmm. Okay. Oop. There we go. Yay. Job's a good one. Okay, I did this. I did stuff. You did what? <gasps> Ooh! Stairs! Proper stairs, with railing. Is it the stairway to heaven? That's the stairway to the workshop, if I could steer. I put in some windows, because natural light. Oh my gosh. Nice. Oh, this is quite a good space for a workshop, isn't it? No. You can see what I was doing. All the way over there. Oh, yeah. Color coded progress. Okay. Mine's out this window. I did this in here and then this over here. It's getting to be a nice little field, though. Mm. Slowly working on dirt with it, but whatever. Yeah, well, you can see I'm working on the cobblestone, and then there's going to be dirt to go over it. And... Yeah, I'm doing it in this, and then I'm slowly doing the dirt over it, because to make more slabs, I need the things, and yeah. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. So, did we decide where we were going to put the... We need a flint and steel, don't we? Oh. And we need to decide where we're going to put the nether portal. Yeah. And one of us... Yeah, I'm going to off... I'm actually going to offload as much as I can, so I'm going to head back to... Ilafad. Okay, I'm gonna go little, hunt for a flint and steel. Do a little inventory done. I don't know if we already have flint and steel. Me either. That's why I'm at least looking. Well, oh, that's a lot of rubber. Hey, we got a jukebox. Hey, we got a blaze rod. Where do we get a blaze rod? I've, I've got a frozen client, which is up. Oh. That's not oh, good. There we go. No, it was frustrating me. I was about to punch the computer. Don't do that. Wait, do you punch the screen or do you actually punch the computer? Both, sometimes. Oh. My mouse is just really not behaving itself. I'm getting annoyed with it now. No, I only um, wanted one. There we go. I didn't want okay. 63. Go, go in your home. Oh my gosh. Did you know? <laughs> Throwing things at a barrel does not get them in there. Does it not? No! I must have, like, terrible aim or something. Alright, I have made a flint and steel. Heaven help us. I'm just trying to find my, um, quest book. I've just kind of forgotten Not about it. I have so much backlog quests. Yes, but we'll need to know that we get to the right coordinates, because there's another one that says, go to these coordinates. If we don't do that, then... Actually, I'm going to sleep before we go. Okay. So you've got a flint and steel, I've got the obsidian. I've got a quest book. I've got a quest book also, and I've got my warp book. And so we're going to warp to central. Okay, so... Okay. So that's it? We just have to go there? I think so. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. This sounds like a terrible idea. I don't actually have any weapons. Except for a hammer. But I'm not anticipating getting into any fights, are you? No, but I have got an axe. Well, I have an axe and a pick, and a hammer, and the hammers have proven somewhat effective. 
Yes, sir. Alright, so do we want uh, another out here? Yeah, I think you mentioned something about the possibility of doing it on the top of this thing. Well, that's because I thought it set fire to things. But oh, in this world, I wouldn't an an anticipate that. But if anything does come out, it can fall. I'm not liking the sound of No. Wow, this place sounds... Oh, they're falling to their death down there. How do we get up? Yes. Well, we're not going to get up to the top, because... Oh. Yeah. Well, that's not helpful. That staring oh my gosh. That's flatter and he goes there. Okay. There. Oh my gosh. What? What's? What is this thing cranking out down here? Wow. Things are dying down here. It's really loud. I and bits, can't. Bits and pieces are being collected. I don't know where. Okay, well we'll need to figure that part out. Yes. Otherwise, there's very little point in them actually kind of falling to their deaths if the bits aren't being collected. Well, what about your mob essence thing? What do you mean, what about my mob essence thing? Well, what, I don't even know what it is. It's a bucket of mob essence, or a tank. Yeah, it's a tank. Oh. It's over there. It's, a, it's about kind of 500 million miles away. Okay. Um, okay. Do we want to put it on the walkway out there? Or do we want to put it somewhere else? I'm open to suggestions. Um, let's put it on the walkway for the time being. Okay, it can always move, or we can just break the whole thing when we get tired of it. Tired or terrified? Take your pick. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hello. There. Rumbling thunder. It's going to be off-center. Lay it on its side, then. Do it three wide and two tall. See if it works. Yeah, and if it doesn't, then we've got to get some a diamond pick. I'll, I'll go diamond tip the pick that I've got. Yeah. Okay, well, let's try it sideways and see if it works first. You're crazy. <laughs> the nether shouldn't be so picky. Yeah, but it will be. It may. Well, I've uh, I have made weird shaped and giant ones before. Really getting annoyed with this kind of aphasia that I'm having. I'm going to really punch this computer. Do we need to sort it out? Punch it so hard. <laughs> there we go. Okay, I guess that's one way to sort it out. Mhm. Mm well, or not. It's still not a happy pa happy pappy. Oh. There we go. Maybe not. So before I destroy my mouse, mm -hmm. we'll take a small break. Okay. Okay. Um, so we'll see if new batteries in the mouse work. So before I throw the mouse around the room. Technology. Yeah. Well, I was debating picking it up by its tail and fiddling it around, but yeah. I'm gonna go diamond. I don't think that would work. Yeah, it doesn't work here. I think that's versioning. Okay. Okay, so. Can I just say, told you so. Uh, you said, I'm not gonna deny that. You said, turn it on its side and see if it works. I have had sideways ones, and I really like them. They're more design aesthetic, I guess. Does this even have anywhere to go? I don't even know. Let's find out. If not, I'll just make another one. Denied. Wait, why does it have redstone on there? Mm. Mm -hmm. Do you have a pick we can diamond? <laughs> Apparently not. It might need to be repaired first, though. Uh, here's some iron. Assumes that it's um, it's flint. <laughs> it's flint. Uh, okay, I'll go get flint then. It looks like iron. Uh, which means it's only copper. Which means it's if you diamond tip it, that's not going to kind of. Oh, it's not going to do it. Do the job, is it? Hmm. Or will it? I don't know. No, it probably won't. It 
probably won't. I don't know. So, one of these. One of these. Not that. One of these. Hey, what's in the tinkers thing? It's mm. empty. Yeah, because it's been automatically differing the, the schmugger. Oh. So I've, I've been running it with the redstone clock. Excellent. Okay, well, let's gonna make one of these now. Um. Is an iron pick one ingot or two to make? One. Cool. We'll just melt one down. Melt one down, pass it around. Alright, and this can hang out here too. Cool. I think I can, if I do it with a wooden handle, I can automatically put an upgrade on it, right? Uh, I th think so, maybe? Well, I was able to do it right away with my, uh, with my axe. And it has a yeah, wooden but... tool handle. Yes. I don't know. I'm not saying anything, because then I can't be proven wrong. <laughs> I'm just going based on very vague memories. Have you done it yet? Have you done it yet? Have you done it yet? Working on it. Uh, well, part of me is stalling also to get the iron melted and done. Do I have a tool yeah. in here? No, that's a chisel head. Is it melted well, yet? Have... I don't know. No. You're in charge of the melting. melting. Well, it's not melted yet. Yeah, so ingots do tend to take a little time. So, I'm not sure, did we actually explain why we're going to the nether? No, we could probably talk about that now, though. Yeah, so... Before we transfer stuff upstairs, um, I want to try and take up less room for power generation, uh, which requires lava generation at the moment, until we get further advance. So, Kara had a wonderful suggestion, because I got that pyrothium um, some time ago, that we could use that, but we need to make it flaming. And to make it flaming, we need a magma crucible! And to make a magma crucible, magma crucible, or however you say that, we need to go to the nether, because we need netherrack. And unfortunately, my sludge boiler has let us down and has only made one. And we need at least eight. So. Impatience for the win. Well, we want to start moving stuff and getting stuff set up upstairs. And I've got ideas for how to kind of move this and kind of work it the same Set for almost the same as it is, but kind of change things a little bit with my own own little twiddle on stuff. Twiddle on stuff? Yes. Okay. You didn't say thanks because you didn't want to be proven wrong. Just as well. Mm -hmm. Apparently would have been proven wrong. Okay. Hey, we've got like 16 diamonds. I'm just going to make a vanilla diamond pickaxe. Is that even a thing? About to find out, I think so. Shh. Exactly. There's no sticks in there. Yes, it would appear that there are normal vanilla diamond pickaxes. How simple is that? About as simple as a simple thing on a simple day in a very simple mode. Oh my gosh, I cannot find any. I'm walking around on all this wood saying I can't find any wood. Okay. I can't take the the museum apart. Yeah, this is true. Oh, well. Replanting will happen when saplings drop. Taken care of. Thank you. I'm going to not jump and bounce around because otherwise I'll just lose <laughs> my stuff quicker. Uh, yeah. Okay, there we go. Minor, minor set back aside. Do you want? Here you go. Present for you. Oh, so I get to go and take it apart because I put it the way you told me to put it. Oh well, I can I do it too. I, mean, mm. I see how it is. <laughs> mm. <laughs> What's harvest level diamond mean? Harvest a diamond. Oh. Doesn't seem to be working very well. Yeah, this. 
not acting as a diamond pickaxe. <sighs> you know what? It might be oh, faster. It's because I'm using the. It's because I'm. No, I'm, I'm using the right pickaxe. But it's a diamond pickaxe. But when I hover over the obsidian, uh, uh, it tells me that it's not currently harvestable with this pickaxe. Oh. Because it needs harvest level diamond. <laughs> So then the, the pick that I've had all along is apparently workable? Does it give you a tick saying harvestable? It says an X and says currently harvestable. Here, look at it. Well, then that means it's not going to do the job. Oh. If you oh my gosh. Take your, I'm going to go get a buck. Take it and... Yeah. Take it and hover over the cobblestone. Oh, okay. It's yeah. Harvestable. Right. Okay. Okay, so, um, flailing and failing. I'm just going to make more obsidian. <laughs> yeah. Kind of gathered that one was coming. I'm sorry I was wrong, okay? I can admit it. Except I've left my buckets back on my island, so... You can borrow my warp book. It's on a shelf over there. Uh, my warp book's here somewhere as well. I really don't like it. Is there a trick to doing the lava? Yeah. No. <laughs> There's no trick to it. Let's just don't... Just click carefully, basically. <sighs> don't do it. Click carefully, right? Okay, you do the lava. Yeah, this this would be click not clicking carefully when you kind of you appear. See, this is why I'm doing the water. Uh huh. Because that wouldn't have been uh, wouldn't have been fun, would it? No. <sighs> I'm I'm here today with Derpy Tevers. <laughs> you know what? We're learning things. learning how to run out of lava. Can you take the the lava out of the one next to it? It's got two. Or we'll just switch it on to obsidian. Because we only need two more. Yeah, but there's, there isn't one single crucible that has got enough lava in it to make a bucket at the moment. No, I mean the, the this thing, the igneous extruder right here. I don't think you can take it out. Why don't we switch that one on to Obsidian then? Because it's okay, because we're about to get to <laughs> Okay. But no, I, I know of a different way. There we go. Where'd you get that lava from? Magic. Oh, the tank? Yeah. I didn't even know there was a tank back there! Well, there you go. See? Excellent. Okay, so we're going to try this again. And this time we're not going to care if it's yep. off-centered? Well, we're probably going to care, but we're just not going to kind of make a thing out of it. Yeah. Because... Well, we could place it long ways. Still so bummed that this one didn't cooperate. Why do I have... <clears throat> Why do I have detector rails? Mm -hmm. Why do you have detector rails? I don't know. Why did I do that? I did it wrong. What you did? I need one more obsidian. Why? Because I've played three down. Why can my stone hammer harvest obsidian? I don't know either. I'm really confused. And I'm going Does to... It actually, it actually gives a green tick? Yep. Okay. I've started chipping away at it, so I'm just going to sit here and stare at it. Bloop. Oh, you liar. You say it's harvestable, but then you break it. Line stink. Did it give you something different instead? Uh, not unless it went on top. No? It just says it's harvestable, and then nope. 
Yes. Okay, so you need one more bit? Yes, please. All right. Instead of you breaking a bit that wasn't possibly going to be useful. <laughs> if it would have actually been harvestable, it would have been plenty useful. Shh. Yeah, but the hammer would have changed it into anything, into something else. Like anyway, like it changes bone into gravel and stuff like that. There. Have you got the lava sorted, or there? Get your thing. Right. All all this just to get Nether out. <laughs> I know. We, 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 this... I had such high hopes for this episode. Yeah, we'll get the power sorted. We'll get the magma crucible built. Mm -mm. We'll build <laughs> a Nether portal. Here you go. And oh, I see. <laughs> You're getting it set on fire. <laughs> okay. Me first. Let's see what's going on. Alright. This is a very, very quick exploratory mission. Oh, we're not going to try to get the thing where it said we needed to? Um, d oh, no we're not. Someone's already trying to kill me. Oh, okay. Are you coming back then? I'm, I'm coming back. <laughs> what's after you? I don't know. Um, but I'm now on the Red Stained Island. In a new nether portal. Oops. With no warp book, right? Uh, I do have my warp book. Oh, that's good. I'm glad I didn't go. I wouldn't have got back. Exactly. So we're going to need to figure that out. So. Hmm. It'd be interesting. So. Okay. So Actually. what are the what are the thoughts on this then? What was trying to kill you? A zombie pigman came at me. Oh, they're constantly aggro now? I don't know. Ugh. Let me let me go back and see what happens. We'll give it one more shot. That's all we want some stinking netherrack. Wait, the red island's just on the other side of this tower. Yeah, well we're gonna have to get to the red island to... Alright, I'll go get some cobblestone and start on that. Um, there's now Pigman looking at me, but not doing anything. Oh, that's good. Oh, he's coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. Running is a good thing. I'm going. I don't know where he goes, but when he, when they teleport, he doesn't come through with. Seem to. I wouldn't complain about that. I'm not. Um, but what I do want to do is um, I will. I'll set up. I get um. Another nether, another nether, um, another um, ender pearl, and I can then set a warp book to go out here, and we can then destroy the portal there potentially. And then, if anything does come through, it's only on this island, and it's completely segregated from the rest of the world. Except for the bridge that I'm going to have to build to get out there myself. Why do you have to build a bridge? How? Oh, do you, because if I go out there, I have no way back. Um, if we have warp books. If I go out there and die, then I really have no way back. We have warp books. There's a strong box here. There's an entire island. Okay. Um. Do you want me to make Ooh. a warp page so you can go back out there? That's all right. We'll figure that out. But um, <laughs> we we'll figure that out and we'll get that all kind of navigable and stuff between now and next episode. And we'll probably even try and figure out a diamond tipped sword and clean up that obsidian over there as well. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry. But yes, yeah, so uh, until next time, take care, folks. Bye, guys.